Hello, and welcome to the Mighty Thoughts video series, where each episode we share resources, tips, and ideas on how to build problem-solving skills in today's youth. Mighty Thoughts is brought to you by Mighty Camp, a summer camp that maximizes fun, builds problem-solving skills, and leaves parents proud of their child's growth. Hi there, everybody. Welcome to our second installment of the Mighty Thoughts video series. I'm Spencer Kay, the programming director for Mighty Adventure Camp here at our North location in Colorado, and I'm joined by Will Jones, our director of the Mighty Adventure Camp here at our North location of Colorado. And we're here to talk to you about a book called Mindset by Carol DeWick. And so, Will, what did you enjoy about the book? Yeah, um, man, I learned a lot uh, in this book, and the biggest thing I learned was the difference between a growth and a fixed mindset. So growth mindset uh, is one where a child feels like as when they fail, uh, they have the ability to uh, look at that situation and say, I can do better. I can uh, work to improve. Uh, and this is such a critical part of, we believe, child's growth. Um, and for a fixed mindset, that would be when somebody fails, it's like, uh, this is really the best I can do. I'm not going to improve. And so they're scared to fail because of that. Um, and so my biggest takeaway, the thing that I love the most about the book was something called the power of yet. And the power of yet is when someone, when the child is stuck in that fixed mindset, um, and they say, man, I can't succeed at this. We, we kind of toss this three letter word in there yet. So it's, I can't succeed at this yet. So it gives them this, um, helps to rewire them to think, okay, from this growth mindset perspective, I can do this and it uh, helps their growth. So that's where our goal for camp this summer. Absolutely. Well, thank you, Will. One of the parts that I really enjoyed is effort-based praise. Um, so it's really praising kids' effort, um, not just the success that they have at the end. Take, for example, if your child has a math test and maybe they don't get as, as uh, high of score that they want, uh, letting your child know that it's still the effort, the time that they studied to go into it is really the value of the entire process, not necessarily just the end result. So really praising that effort, letting them know that if they just continue to work at something, uh, uh, that it's really that effort that we put into something is really where the results come out. So it's a really fantastic book. I uh, really recommend that you read it yourself as well. And uh, we'll see you next time for our third installment of the Mighty Thoughts video series.